Hey, this is Superheroes Den One uh, doing a short uh, pickups video on uh, some comics I got. Um, and if I have time, I'll do a review. Otherwise, I'll just scrap it and do a review on another video. Um, I got uh, today. I haven't read it yet, but I got the second part of Age of Ultron, book two. The first part was awesome. It's more based in the future. Um, really cool. Ultron pretty much took over the world, and there's like all these Ultron robots and stuff, and <clears throat> uh, most of the Avengers were killed um, or captured, and uh, Captain America is doubting himself, and because of the stuff that happened, he led the team in that actually was killed. Hawkeye's pretty much taken the control reins of the Avengers that are left, and it's pretty interesting. It's a good series. Um, definitely worth the time to uh, pick up and read. So, <clears throat> um, Uncanny uh, X Men number three. Uh, this is uh pretty good as well. Magneto's betraying Cyclops and. Uh, that's where this story is kind of progressing right now, so, <clears throat> because he's upset about his powers being, uh, stripped away from him because of the Phoenix and stuff like that, so it's, it's an interesting story and where it's going with it. Um, I also got Wolverine and the X-Men number 26, um, Wolverine's brother Dog returns from Origins, and they kind of lead off from that one, <clears throat> uh, or from the last issue when he showed up in uh, Wolverine and X Men. Uh, also, I haven't read it yet, but uh, Wolverine number one just came out, so pretty cool. Uh, I didn't know it was out yet, so and I wound up seeing it at my other comic book store I go to, um, so I decided I was going to pick this one up. <clears throat> uh, also picked up Smallville, season 11, uh, issue 11. So I have not read any of these yet, so I don't know anything in what's going on with any of this yet. But I kind of wanted to get through the Smallville series, but I don't know. I'm thinking I might be letting this series go. I don't know. I just haven't had time to get into it. Um, Captain America, uh, number 250. I really love this cover. It's, uh, it says on there, he's the people's choice. Captain America for president. Pretty neat issue. So, I only paid two bucks for it, so I figured it was worth it. And it was uh, where he was uh, running for president, I think, or something like that. Not sure what's going on with that. I haven't read it yet, so I don't know. Um, Captain America, number 264. Uh, it's got, uh, and it's also Falcon issue. It's got uh, the original X-Men up on here. So, I figured I'd pick it up. I thought it looked kind of neat. And it also had the X-Men in it. Uh, Captain America 341, Cap versus Iron Man. Uh, this looked like kind of a fun uh, versus title. But this is where uh, U.S. Agent actually took over as Captain America for a while. So, And that was my uh, pickups for today. Uh, my comic haul. I got a little bit of time, so I'll do a uh, review. I'm not sure how that's going to go right yet, but uh, I'll get, or how long it'll take me to do it. So I don't know if this will be the only one I do for a review on this issue, but I'll start it. Um, Batman Incorporated uh, from the New 52, number 8. Uh, this is the one where uh, Damian Wayne dies. Um, it was really good. I really, really enjoyed it quite a bit. Um, you find out that uh, 
him and uh, er, Damian Wayne and uh, Nightwing and Commissioner Gordon are like trying to save these children and uh, Damian Wayne's uh, real mom Tala Raza Ghoul's daughter uh, winds up uh, <clears throat> sending uh, this huge bulky looking guy Let's see if I can find him give me just a sec flipping through these yeah he was just a beast of a guy yeah there he is coming out of the elevator with two guys and then uh, they wind up taking out the two guys with them and then you see kind of on the bottom here and he they wind up starting to attack uh, this big guy uh, right there where uh, Damian Wayne and uh, Nightwing are battling them and they wind up pretty much just getting pummeled by him um, and later on you find out that it's a clone uh, that's enhanced and he winds up pretty much just beating the crap out of uh, Nightwing and then uh, Damian Wayne just puts out his best effort in battle to try to defeat him it's really good I mean Damian Wayne never even flinched or gave up in the battle. Um, he fought to no end. He didn't cower. He didn't beg for mercy. And at the end, he was pretty much skewered by this guy, this behemoth clone that of <clears throat> the clones actually of Damian Wayne. So. Um, it's actually an interesting, uh, story. It kind of sucks that they had to kill him at the end. Batman shows up, but he was too late, and there wasn't much that could have been done. And it's kind of leading off to where Batman's insanity, er, insanity is going to start. So, but it sucks that, I, I don't know. I had actually a tough time with Damian Wayne at first. But the guy kind of grew on me. I mean, he was a really cool character after you started getting used to him. And really started to feel for this character. Uh, but definitely, yeah, pick it up. It's number eight. Um, good, good, good story. So, um, Also, Justice League of America, I haven't done anything on it yet. I did pick it up. Uh, number one, uh, the flag issue. Um, I kind of wanted to wait until I got some of my other issues that I had on hold. So it's kind of running a little late. I didn't like the story on it, really. I I don't know. It was just kind of leading up to uh, the Justice League of America forming and who's all going to be on the team and whatnot. So that's pretty much all that was about. And it was just, I don't know. It wasn't really my thing, but... I got the South Dakota issue since I am from South Dakota. So, um, I also got the North Dakota issue. Uh, the Minnesota issue. I got the Iowa issue and Nebraska issue. And then I wound up picking up the Mississippi issue today. So if it, if anybody else has any of these other issue covers, I would like to get them. I mean, I mean if you guys still have them around or whatnot um, and you want to trade or sell, let me know and I'll pick them up from you. Um, I know my local comic book store here in town uh, actually has a couple of them but it, they don't have them all so 
But again, um, I'm looking for those. The superheroes didn't one out. If you have them, hit me up, and we could possibly set up a trade or so. So superheroes didn't one. I'm up for the day. Have a great day.